So there's something I didn't cover in the last video, and that is how to turn on two-factor authentication and also how to install Clam AV, which is important for protecting email and also protecting file uploads. So let's start by seeing how you can enable two-factor authentication on your WHM. This is usually found under Security Center, but you can just search for it. You can just search for Tufa. And that's going to bring this option. You can click on it to enable two-factor authentication. So if you come down here, you're going to see two-factor authentication is off. You just need to turn it on. And now it's on. Now the next step is to set up two-factor authentication for WHM. But first, you, you can change the issuer here. And this is just what's going to appear on your authentication app. So I can call this WHM. And let's save. There we go. The next step is to enable two-factor authentication for WHM. So I'm just going to click there on manage my account and make sure you have your phone ready. You need to download Google Authenticator or whichever authentication app you use. Go to your phone, open Google Authenticator. You can see the status is not configured. So I'm going to click there on setup to factor authentication. I can scan the QR code. There we go. And then I need to enter the security code. So on your authenticator app, you're going to see the name my WHM server one or whichever name you chose. So enter the security code that's currently active. You can configure to factor authentication. All right. So my account is configured with two factor authentication. I can actually test it. Let me log out and log back in. And now it's asking for the security code on my on my app. There we go. Tufa is now enabled for WHM. The next thing I want to enable is Clam AV, which is an antivirus that protects email and file uploads. So I'm just going to search for plugins. And you can see it is under the cPanel tab. So I'm just going to click there on manage tabs, manage plugins, I mean. And then I'm going to scroll down and I can install Clam AV. So you can see the installation is in progress. Let's wait. So I'm getting this warning, but let me just go to plugins and see if it's installed. I can collapse all of this. And then if you come down to plugins, you'll see. Okay, I have to refresh the page. And now we can see Clam AV is there. And I can click on configure. I'll just click on save to save these configurations. I don't have any users, but if I did have users, you can actually go in and override various configurations for specific users. So if you add a user there, you can select what needs to be scanned and then you save that. But you can just leave it at the default settings. That's what I wanted to cover in this video. Most importantly, it's very important for you to enable two-factor authentication. So once you enable Tufa, even cPanel will have multi-factor authentication feature enabled on it and the users can set their Tufa settings. That's what I wanted to do in this video to enable two-factor authentication and also to install Clam AV. So that's it. Let's continue in the next part. And in the next part, let's see how to run your first website. Of course, you're going to create a cPanel account and then see how you can run your first website. See you then.